Hello, greetings, my friends. I'm uh, returning to do a last video. I'm uh, getting ready for traveling. I thought I, I pull out some oracles as well. Uh, what I wanted to, to discuss different ideas, the one I'm talking a lot about letting go, letting go, letting go, but it's not about letting go of the desire and the fulfillment. It's letting go of the resistance to receive the desire and the fulfillment. So it is very important to... Um, to, uh, to integrate that and to, so that we can move forward and be fulfilled within the, with, with, on, on all levels, for it is really uh, connecting to the I am presence, is the, is the perfect harmonization of the divine feminine, divine masculine, within, without, uh, with all that entails. The highest wisdom is the cosmic carrot. Continue to follow the guidance. Very important to listen to your inner voice and, and, and those messages that seem to come from a higher plane of intelligence. What we need to understand is the Mount Meru, the center of the universe, to focalize on the center, always be in the center of you, always focalize on the center of the universe and, and open your door to connect, have a direct link to that center. The Mount Meru is a mystical mountain that connects Shambhala, the inner earth, to the heavens. Um, and so what we need to do is the wish for feeling gem. It is about joy, fun, sharing. Uh, here it's, uh, it's, it's the deep alchemistry. It's the power of choice, the power of sex, the power of romantic love. Uh, and the outcome is the scarlet woman. It is a universal card. Huh? It's, the, it's, the, it's the great mother. It is the... the, the, the do not, we do not want to, we want to get lost in the details. We'll see the life as a whole. So, um, so because we, we keep asking things to add to the universe, the universe always says yes, but we, we have certain um, um, uh, resistance to, to, to receiving what we've been asking for. Uh, but we, when we ask uh, for things that are very, very uh, limited, we get, it's like fast food. It's not really, it, it comes really quickly, but it's not really fulfilling. But when we, we ask for, um, for gourmet food, for, for like more refined experiences in life, sometimes it takes longer to get to, to, um, to prepare, but it will be a lot better to, uh, to, to, to focus on, on good, on, on preparing this higher level of experience and so um, and connect to the brotherhood of intelligence for there is only this this one connected field and so um, and to know our place in uh, in the mission will make it a lot easier and for, we'll be able to focus on the responsibilities of what we need to uh, to address i'm going to pull some cards with the akash so i make a mix of uh, to use all the decks i have here the highest wisdom is trust and faith. So just trust and faith. What we need to understand is the karmic relationship. Is we, we are bounded to, to certain people to meet. To, to, everything is connected. It's one, and it's all. So so it's about um, unconditional love transcends uh, karma. Uh, dharma transcends karma. What we need to do is, is the galactic. Is connect to our galactic nature to remember our galactic nature. What, and and the outcome will be the arts, the appreciation of beauty and the, the joy, the, the of sharing. So it's going to be quite wonderful. And so, uh, um, for I was talking about group consciousness, uh, the meditations, it's like uh, I want to send greetings to the fr friends in Ibiza. Uh, I'm going to go there. I don't know what they do. I think they do it every night. They, uh, they gather together. Um, to meditate at 21, 21 hours. So, but uh, what I saw is that at those times, it's like a beacon of light that is uh, that is uh, opening there. But but I don't know. I haven't seen really what's happening in other timelines. Uh, I'm uh, friends in Spain, so maybe I'll, I'll go visit there. And um, for for and uh, when we do meditation in groups it's important to remind ourselves that uh, it is the connection to our divinity within it is the ultimate key it is the the key to the ascension and and, and that is one person that is connected to his divinity inside is more powerful than 8 billion people who are not huh? so so it is always focus on your inner self your inner connection first in regardless before you tune in to to collective energies or egregores and because when you're one with your source you you are one with trillions of spiritual beings as well that are connected in, in a way that is appropriate and but um 
countless uh, ca this countless uh, brotherhood of intelligence and uh, but it's a unipolar field and it's like uh, it's like uh, going home it's like remembering to be with god all the time will bring you home um i'm gonna pull some more cards let's see i haven't pulled uh, did i pull those no i'm gonna take I'm just go I'll do some oracles today as a getting ready to leave so i'm in my luggage and packing and uh, the highest wisdom is all that shines for all that shines is like uh, is this is the other world is crumbling all their plants now the light is everywhere everything is uh, is uh, there is all these surface things but there is all kinds of new things that are also coming into our experience we need to enjoy it enjoy them enjoy the material world as well because the mat matter needs to be loved there is the elemental forces within matter and matter doesn't sometimes doesn't understand why it's not loved and what's uh, um those elementals what we need to understand is a new life there's this new life that's going to be unfolding that is happening uh, what we need to to do is the wind of change to 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 to, to know that um, what well, this card tells you that you don't know the which way the wind will blow but you you, you continue with trust and, and be flexible and the outcome is co-creation there is a powerful time of co-creation it means collective also to to, to, to co-create together when the when anytime you communicate with somebody you co-create we are co-creating a conscious uh, uh, and um, ideas with everything it builds in the universe in this magnetic universe so um I've been working with the Arcturians also on some on some technology, but it's, I don't know when it's going to be happening. It's like an energy matrix, very beautiful. It's very complex, uh, but it's um, there is all kinds of um, of memory of this crystals technology for the fifth dimensional for fifth dimensional. Um, technologies will be um, will be based on crystal technologies and they already are, they, they still the, the many of the sacred crystals of atlantis are still on the planet they will be reactivated and so because those crystal technology the, the those memories of atlantis sometimes can just be transported in the time before on Atl on, um, on poseida or, uh, or during the golden age of atlantis um to, to realize that you you have those memories uh, in, of the crystal chambers and and some of the crystals uh, were uh, are directed towards um, towards south florida in south beach it was i used to live there and uh, and spirit confirmed to me that there was very powerful fire crystals that uh, and so there's a lot of energy people go there and and, and party and whatever but uh, but for spiritual work it is very very powerful all this area like the bermuda triangle uh, the, the disturbance of the bermuda triangle is uh, caused by the fact that uh, the, the after the, the, there was this master's chamber of Atlantis, uh, of the masters of Atlantis. It was an enter. Uh, it was, they could move into different timelines and places, and uh, it was a multi-dimensional portal, physical temple. Uh, when he, uh, he, he, after the, the destruction of Atlantis, he became completely. Uh, it wasn't totally destroyed, but he was. Uh, he wasn't uh, regulated to operate uh, on command. It was just random. App. So anybody that's that goes into its field it can be propulsed at different time space location um, and it, it's like uh, it's located north of Bimini Island uh, there, there may be a rescue uh, operation that I don't know if it's possible. It's very, very delicate because it's like uh, just to approach it, it has to be done with uh, with extraterrestrial. I'm sure with uh, assistance with the of the Arcturians at, at this point, or also being Syrians, maybe he will be able to help and assist because it would be interesting to to, to retrieve that, uh, that that great chamber, the master chamber of Atlantis, uh, and realign it. So, but the humans are not ready yet, but uh, it, will, it might come. For, for the time in fifth in fifth dimension, uh, when you go through those portals, it's very very different. Like one day is like a hundred years, like one day. Huh? It's like uh, things are very very different. Um, but but it's slower too. The evolution is slower as well. The highest wisdom is laziness, so it's okay to be lazy. Hmm? <laughs> What we need to understand is politics. It's like all of those worlds of lies and deceptions. So it's like uh, then we move in understanding the projections is like we we're projecting an idea on the screen actually, but uh, the, which is not the truth. The truth is a unipolar reality of uh, of life and evolution. But but uh, the, there is this duality principles and and what 
what we see of that politics is, is actually um, we see, see some some things that are that are dark, and so we're projecting our, our, our point of view on the screen in relationship to that. And, and then it gets intense. But we, uh, what we need to understand is the will of fortune, the will of great change, the the the, the connection to the, the the flower of life. So that uh, what we need to do is to continue to share. To be sharing is compassion. Is the, the is uh, to to reveal things uh, to to bring back to the forefront of consciousness. And the outcome will be patience. It means there is no hurry in relationship to many things. Just be. Uh, just find your joy in in what you do. Yeah. We have to be patient also because a higher sense has been attuned to who come online. It's like uh, the, the new senses are coming online. Uh, for uh, for photonic light uh, that we've been using, photonic light um, can be manipulated as in quantum dynamics. Whatever I focus on, the light will go in that direction. But but uh, this this photonic light has been very much replaced. There is an alignment between the central sun, the the, the sun and the earth. That uh, that this photonic light has been replaced with plasmic golden plasmic. Um, light that that is not corruptible that is not uh, uh, because it it, it is mixed with the white light um, the white light of the of the source so this cosmic this this plasmic light that is entering its golden light that is entering into the planet that is entering into us as well is um, is the christ light so it is and, and that is really a, a big uh, we're going to feel a major transformation as um as time goes on in relationship to the integration of that christ consciousness that plasmic light for I realize one thing also to conclude with that um, I'm going to some card. the highest wisdom is is uh, is healing what we need to, to understand is a lear learning process we are we learning what we need to do is overcome hesitation and the outcome will be revelations once we go beyond our hesitation we'll find depart stay living well, we don't need to hesitate. And so I wanted to say that I realized something. For a very long time, I thought that when, when the God said uh, that they created man in their own image, first, uh, I mean, the, the, not in terms of, I never really could associate the physical body as a beautiful divine creation, but but it, I always regarded it as the soul. The soul was like this eternal being who's fragmented. But the soul is a memory cell. It only started at some point. The, the, the true self who God created in his own image is our beloved I am presence. It's the pure, the pure spirit of God with all the potentials of God. And, and it's, it's, it partners with the soul in, in experiences all the way to the point where there is uh, the soul has mastered all the lessons that, that we need to master in order to, 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 to fuse with to come together with our I am presence, but the, the I am presence and its alignment, this fusion, is the, the ultimate key to, to 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 the ascension, to the return to the the center, to, re, to the return to paradise. And so, uh, so we want to thank our beloved I am presence, the beloved I am presence of all beings on the planet and the, and and the universe. For this, uh, I'm gonna then I'm, I'm gonna sing a song. I thank you very much for liking, sharing, listening to those videos. To, to I hope continue to work with. Uh, do not let yourself be distracted by the puppet show out there. Huh? It's a puppet show. Don't get involved in the drama of the puppet show. It's all. It's all. It's all going to be crumbling soon, and it's going to be very. Um, but focus on on your joy, your happiness, your own timeline of, of freedom. And so this song, I'm going to sing. I'm not going to sing it. Uh, it's a bit old song. I'm not going to sing it like um, like uh, Joe Cooker. It's a song about friendship. It goes like this. What would you do if I sang out a song? Would you stand up and walk out on me? Lend me your ear and I sing you a song. I will try not to sing out a key. Oh, I get by with a little help from my friends. Oh, I get high with a little help from my friends. Oh, I'm going to try with a little help from my friends. What do I do when our love is away? Does it worry you to be alone? How do I feel by the end of the day? Are you sad because you're on your own? 
No, I get by with a little help from my friends. Do you need anybody? I need somebody to love. Could it be anybody? I want somebody to love. Would you believe in a love at first sight? Yes, I'm certain that it happens all the time. What do I see when you turn off the light? I can't tell you, but I know it's mine. Oh, I get by with a little help from my friends. Oh, I get high with a little help from my friends. Oh, I'm gonna try with a little help from my friends. With a little help from my friends. And the final card of the day, we'll have, it was the, the beautiful Ariel that uh, will give it to us. Thank you, Ariel. Show us the miracle every day. Show us a miracle every day. It's the Lady of Ariel, mature, practical spirit, generous and happy to ask for a miracle uh, every day. is practical and, uh, and happy. Uh, take, take care of you and those you love. Capacity to, to make everything more beautiful. Advices that are both practical and wise. So, um, so yes, it is the poet who is able to see the beauty of the to, to, um, to make the to make life beautiful in the monotony of of, of daily life to, to transform things. To, so we have this power. So, so stay tuned, stay in your inspiration. I wish you a wonderful day, and I'll talk to you later. Adonai.